Hey, good morning, Summit. This is Edward, and you know Jake. This is your weekly update coming at you right now. Make sure you share it on all your platforms. Uh, Jake had a great week this last week, a lot of stuff going on. Um, it, last Saturday, that clear the tree deal, that you, I don't know if you know what was going on last Saturday, but uh, at Pastor Andrew they were clearing uh, the tree. Works with, uh, did a ministry called Clear the Tree where they work to uh, basically meet all the needs of Angel Tree kids uh, in, in the area. And last week, I know some of you guys participated, and this is why we want to celebrate it. Uh, he shared that 150 to 160 kids uh, needs were met last mm -hmm. Saturday. And so uh, we just want to say thank you, Summit, if you participated in that. If you are first time hearing this and uh, you said, man, I want to do that, uh, mm -hmm. then next year we're going to have an opportunity to partner with them again. Uh, and hopefully we'll have a ton of shoppers and all the stuff going on over there in, in Longview. So thank you, Summit, uh, for just serving and meeting needs in this uh, community. Yep. And thank you for the angel trees. Thank you for the gift cards that went out to the families and our church that needed help. Thank you for some of the uh, monetary donations that came in that we were able to pass on to some of these families yeah. to give them some food as well as presents and stuff. So it's just a great day meeting needs all around. And I also want to just uh, celebrate you uh, uh, one more time is because last Sunday we preached a message on no, worship. No, no, no. Uh, we, you preached a message. Well, we're a team, though. It's, I, it's, it's nothing to do with it. I oh, had nothing to do with the whole... So so here's what I want to say to you. Thank you for, for just buying in right now. Oh, they bought in? As we're... Oh, okay, we preached a message last Sunday, and thank you for yeah. buying in. Yeah, I see how this is going. Anyway, Summit, thank you so much. We just celebrate you and just what you're doing. And your giving this year has been mind-blowing. Uh, the generosity that we get to be a part of. In fact, we got to meet a need for Mike Brister and Stepstones Ministries, a ministry we've partnered with for, what, 10 years? Oh, a long time. Uh, long time. And uh, we've been to Guatemala with, been to Haiti hey. with, been to Africa. Tennessee. Uh, Tennessee, and so we got to meet some needs this week because of your generosity, and so, uh, gosh, thank you. I, I didn't know we were going to celebrate this much, but there, there's just so much. We've been celebrating for two and a half minutes. Uh, 80 people have already tuned us out. Uh, probably so, because they don't, anyway. Uh, also, to let you know, our budget passed unanimously, unanimously last Sunday. Thank you for being a part of that. Um, it just it's it's a blessing. You're a blessing, Summit, that we get to celebrate you and that we get to serve alongside you and and all that we do in this community. Hey, what do you got this week? Anything? Man, we got to set some boundaries. Hey, have you seen that new taco stand next door? It's not a taco stand. It's like a it's a it's a business. It looks like a taco stand. It's not a taco stand. Taqueria. But to honor the new business that's going in next seriously, door, seriously, and their insurance policies, the way their insurance is written, they can't, they cannot allow people to be parking uh, in their their new establishment. So that is a business now, and they sell gravel and rocks and things of that nature. It's not so, a taco stand. And so we told them that we would make the announcement. We've got plenty of parking in the back. We really don't utilize the that's parking right. that we have in that's the right. back. We really only use it up to about 20, 25% of what's back there. And so let's start parking in the back and, and not park in the in the solid rock uh, parking lot anymore and help those guys out. Yeah, so that's not a taco stand? No. No, they sell rock. They do driveways and rocks and gravel. Oh, and like that. I thought it was a taco stand. So, hey, no cancer support this Sunday because of the holidays and all that's going on. So they will reconvene next month, be looking uh, – for that announcement coming up on your weekly updates and on the church sign out front where those things kind of just rotate back and forth. But uh, no cancer support this Sunday. It'll resume next Sunday or next uh, month. And uh, if you need to talk to somebody, uh, Sherry Sims and Sharon Claxton and some of those ladies that are involved in that, reach out to them. Or reach out to us. We'll get you in touch. Yeah, we can, we can definitely do that too. So uh, it's Christmas, Jake. And by the way, it's warm again outside. I just isn't it crazy? Just baffled. I shouldn't be wearing shorts and short sleeve t-shirts during Christmas time. I know it's December the sixteenth, and this kind of reminds me of Easter. Ridiculous. It's kind of reminds me of Easter because today and tomorrow is going to be kind of hot and balmy and sad because it's not cold. Ridiculous. But guess what happened Sunday? Ridiculous. It's going to be cold Sunday, and so it's kind of like the resurrection. Jesus died on Friday. 
He rose again on Sunday. So this weekend, we're burning up today and tomorrow. And then Sunday, Jake, it's going to be cold. That's pretty good, wasn't it? You just can't go a day without preaching something. Just That's good, isn't it? Calm down. You don't, you don't have to preach every day. December 24th, night of worship uh, for Christmas Eve. Make sure that you're there by 5 o'clock. Bring your family. It will do uh, one hour, and you'll be free to go at 6 o'clock after you've been charged up. And uh, really excited about it's this. Gonna be good. It's going to be really good. In fact, I was listening to some Christmas music this morning, yep. uh, thinking about uh, that night that we're going to be doing. So it's cool. What else you got? Anything, brother? Uh, no, nah, man. I'm just ready for Christmas break. Kids will be out of school, and family will be coming in, and I'll be opening all my presents that you guys are bringing Sunday. You bring them, drop them off Sunday. I'm not going to open them till Christmas Day, though. So I'm looking forward to all that. Hey, if you're still tuned in with us, let me let me say this. Uh, I know that people are still calling us and wanting to know if we're having a Christmas Eve service and uh, we just are things we happening and that we kind of stuff. Them. I know, I know, I know. But some people are not watching these. So encourage people to watch, talk about it. Uh, as you're going along, there's a, a, a Hebrew Shema. Speak about it's it. Talk about preaching. it. And uh, everything just has share, to go back share, to the Bible. Share it. Uh, make sure people preach. know about it. And uh, as you guys are talking back and forth, Summit, we love you. Um, hope you have a great weekend. Uh, come ready and warm Sunday morning because it's going to be cold Sunday morning. And uh, then we are heading to Christmas, Jake. So we love you. See you at 10 o'clock.